Hi, I am Vashan Nazar. I help companies get clients on LinkedIn. I am also LinkedIn trainer and coach. In last video, I already discussed about a DuckSoup Pro. Today, I will show you how you can use DuckSoup Turbo. I already attached the link of DuckSoup Pro in description, so, so please watch the part 1 of DuckSoup training, so you will totally understand about a DuckSoup Pro. So today, we will discuss about a DuckSoup Turbo. Now you can see, in last video, I will I already show you some specification, so you will totally understand. And now, first of all, we need our targeted search. For example, this time my target search is Angel Investor. You just need to click on people. You can also select the location, current company, different filters are available. For example, this time I am just selecting the United States. You can also select the connections. First degree connection, second degree connection or third degree connection. This time I am just targeting the second and third degree connection. And now different filters are more available like follower, followers of location, talks about current company, past company, school, industry, profile languages and different filters are available. You can use these filters according to your requirements. So this time I just need a angel investor from USA and how we can use a duck soup just we need to click on duck soup. Duck soup is the extension of a Chrome browser. And we need just click on option. And then we need to click on manage campaign. And now you can see that this page will be appear. And here you can off or on your campaign. For example, if you want to off this campaign, you just need to click on off and on. In this way you can active and inactive your campaigns. And for example this time we are making a new campaign so you will totally understand how you can run a campaign with the help of DuckSoup. We just need to click on new campaign and need to give the campaign name. I am just writing here the angel investor. You can also write the description about a campaign. And here you need to put first message, second message, third message, fourth message and so on. And your first message, connection message only includes 300 characteristics so I made some message for example I am using this message as a first message just need to copy and just paste here and different placeholders are available FN means first name MN LN CN company name and different placeholders are available you can use this placeholder according to your requirement. So here I need just a first name. I am just writing it F and N and comma. You can also make settings of your messages according to your requirement. And here you can make settings according to your requirement. And this is a plus sign. Here you can add follow up, endorsement, visit for example I am just clicking here the visit and now you can also set here time how much hours you can set here you, according to your requirement you can increase or decrease I am just clicking here after the connection request just after one hour 
and you can add more things like an endorsement of skills and I am just uh, writing here after one day you can add more things according to your requirement and you can also add here the skills sorry this is the endorsement of skills this is a visit you can also visit here just I am writing here after two days one days according to your requirement one day okay and endorsement skill I am just selecting here the after one hour you can select according to your requirement and you can also select here the top one skill top two skills top three skills bottom skill bottom one two three you can select according to your requirement I am just selecting here the top three skills after one hour and visit profile after one day and after this I am sending the second message this is a first follow-up message but our second message this is a connection message it's only includes the 300 characteristics and this is a follow-up message so I am sending here the second message and first our follow-up message and same like you can follow up message third message fourth message and like this you can send a fifth message fourth message fifth message and so on and you can also add here the endorsement and different things are available this time I am just using the first connection message and one follow message if you want to remove this just click on this sign and you can remove and just click on save and if you want to delete this campaign you just need to click on delete and now your campaign is saved now and now different more options are available on your left hand side funnel flow You can select here the different campaigns available and you can also select here the time period and now you can see the performance of your campaign. And now you can see the performance in white 5 acceptance ratio follow-ups and different things you can see now you can select here the campaign name you can also select the range of dates and everything you can select according to your requirement and tag tools options is also available here and now you can add here the tags and you can include and exclude according to your requirements and different activities are available now you can see that you can select show all so you can see the activities of your campaign another option is activity log and now you can see that here you can see different filters are available and you can see the results that are successfully sent the connections successfully the follow-up message and here you can select the field and here you can select the filter by action like a connection request endorsement for example I am just writing here the connection request and these are the amount of connection requests that already filled so different more options are available and now you can see that you can add here the hotspot option is also available so our drip campaign is now ready and now we just need to open our target audience and just run the our campaign and we can also use a sale navigator we can also use a linkedin simple search for example we are satisfied with this search we just need to click on duck soup and here option different options are available like a message for second and third degree connection cancel pending request first degree connection in mails we need to 
put here the subject of emails and body message and different options are available endorsement of skills and here we just need to apply invite from campaign and here we need to select the our campaign for example this time i'm just i'm just selecting here the angel investor one and now we are just opening this and different more options are available in last video i already described these options so you will totally understand about this so when you are satisfied with this target audience then you just need to click on duck soup and just click on visit and connect and now you can see that your duck soup is running now and watching the profile of your target audience and sending the follow up messages sending the connection request endorsement of skills and now your duck soup is working now and if you want you will run this campaign with sale navigator you just need to open your sale navigator <coughs> and i already saved some searches so you can also just need to click on lead filters you can search according to your requirement for example this time i just need angel investors and now you can see that different options are available company head account means how many employees working in a company and current company you can also find a people with the help of current company past company company type and different filters are available and once you are satisfied with your target audience and then you just need to click on duck soup and your duck soup will be run so i am just focusing on second and third degree connection and you when you are satisfied with your target audience you just need to click on duck soup and just click on visit and connect because we already make option of a campaign now you can see that i already selected the angel investor campaign one so this time we just need to click on duck soup and just click on visit and connect and now you can see that your duck soup is running now and sending the connection request sending the follow up message endorsement skills hope you understand about a duck soup so our duck soup training session is in two videos part 1 and part 2 first part in duck soup pro and second part is duck soup turbo hope you all understand if you have any question related to a duck soup then i am available here thank you very much